Hi, I'm Tim Jewett and thanks for watching our DVD today on cooking with planks and with papers. We're going to cook with a variety of wood planks and papers and we're going to do a variety of different dishes. We're going to do seafood, we're going to do meat, and we're going to do several uh, vegetables. Planks can be used outdoors on your barbecue grill over direct heat and papers can either be used over indirect heat on your barbecue grill or inside in the oven. Both impart a very nice mild wood flavor and planks and papers are available in a variety of different woods. We're going to use five different planks tomorrow when we cook and so what we want to make sure is that we've got enough pans so that we can totally submerge each of the planks in water. You want to make sure that you uh, soak your planks for a minimum of an hour but really it's best to soak them overnight and up to 24 hours before you use them. So what we've done is we've just put our cedar planks, the maple plank, and the cherry and the hickory planks in three separate pans. And we're just going to pour some water over the top of them and put some weight on them so that they uh, stay submerged in the water and let them uh, soak overnight. And as you can see, these planks will float, so you want to make sure that you've got some weight to put on top of them so that they sit down in the water. Now we're going to wait until tomorrow. We're going to leave these in the water overnight so they get a really good soak and as you can see we've got them totally submerged in water which is very important and we've got them weighted down because you want to make sure they're not floating you want to make sure they're totally submerged in in the water our planks have been soaking overnight and one of the first things you want to do with your planks after you take them out of the water just before you're ready to put the food on is just kind of wipe the excess moisture off the top of the plank just with one quick wipe and then take a little bit of olive oil not a lot just a little bit and kind of brush it all over the top of the plank and if you brush it into the wood on the top of the plank that helps to make sure that the food doesn't stick and uh, makes it a little bit easier to clean up afterwards. Before we prep any of the food today what we want to do is soak our papers because they're going to need to soak for at least 15 minutes before we put them on the grill or put them in the oven. We're ready to soak these papers and we're going to throw a few skewers in here too because uh, one of the dishes we're doing today is going to use a skewer. Pour the water in. Make sure you've got some weight on it. You want those papers to be totally submerged. And we'll just set those aside. 